Bonjour les amis. Aujourd'hui, on va parler du verbe avoir et ses expressions idiomatiques. C'est à la page 60, les exercices 29 et 30. Le, la première expression, the first expression, c'est avoir sommeil. Répétez, avoir sommeil. Avoir sommeil. And that means we translate it like être, we say to be sleepy, they say to have sleepiness. And don't forget that you have to conjugate avoir. So you would say il a sommeil. Because you'd use the correct form of avoir. You would say ils ont, ils ont sommeil. They are tired, they are sleepy. And you would use the same thing for both of these people. Il a sommeil, elle a sommeil. Ils ont sommeil. There's a little poem here called Sommeil. Regret d'avoir trop dormi en mes âges d'insomniac. Le rêve s'évanouit dès qu'on vit la mac. Le temps sommeil perdu l'est-il en avoir loir doux au noir comptoir des trois parts. Ok, maintenant, uh, l'expression c'est avoir froid. So you can tell this girl is cold because she's wrapped up in a weird, blanky, cozy, cozy thing. Um, so you would say elle a froid. And il a froid. If I was going to say I'm cold, I would say j'ai froid. I have cold, j'ai froid. And that's different than I have a cold, which is something completely different. Um, here's to be hot, j'ai avoir chaud. And as you see that expression here, there's a knitting company called avoir chaud, to be warm or to be hot. Obviously, if you like sweaters and things, you want to be warm. So you might say, elles ont chaud. They are warm. Because um, that can be a good thing or a bad thing. If you were going to say we are warm, you would say nous avons chaud. Um, avoir envie de. You can see that here. Um, this expression is kind of a joke. It says, stop looking at me, you're going to want me. Arrête de me regarder, tu vas avoir envie de moi. And then you see a person listing all the things they want. J'ai envie de chocolat, j'ai envie de sortir. J'ai envie de rire, j'ai envie d'aimer, j'ai envie d'être heureuse. All these things mean I have envy of or I want. And so the expression is avoir envie de. Um, if you want to say they want, you would say elles ont envie de. Or y'all want, you would say vous avez envie de. Uh, now here's to be thirsty, avoir soif, you see that here, um, il a soif, a squirrel is an écureuil, il a soif, elle a soif. Um, here you see the expression avoir faim, to have hunger, to be hungry, il a faim, elle a faim, um, j'ai une faim de loup, I'm hungry as a wolf, j'ai une faim de loup. Here they're saying you can get thin in this book. You can get thin without being hungry. So you might say, he isn't hungry. Il n'a pas faim. Um, here is to need. Avoir besoin de. Here, um, Homer finds out Lisa needs braces. Assurance dentaire, Lisa va avoir besoin de broches. And something else we all need is a... Uh, iPhone. So, avoir besoin de means to need. And if you wanted to say you need, you could say tu as besoin. Excusez-moi. Besoin de. You need. Okay, les amis, au revoir.